to my channel. Today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I go from my day, everyday natural look to a night out, date night look. So this is literally me every day when I want to do something just super simple, super fast, if I want to go run some quick errands. But then if I decide that I want to go out and have some drinks and just change out my makeup a little bit, usually when I'm out and about, I will usually do this to just kind of switch me from day to night. So for this video, I actually am being sponsored by Ofra and I'm going to be talking to you guys about their new shimmer body lotion that is absolutely amazing and perfect for your skin to just give you that nice glowy look, especially at night if you're wearing like a really nice just you know, off the shoulder top or a crop top that just you want to show all the goods and you want to just give it some definition. And this is going to be your go to as well. If you're going to be maybe hitting the sun in the pool or anything like that, you can also do it for that. Um, but I'm going to show you with you guys just my favorite shade and show you guys how I transition from my day look to my night look. So I will have all the details down below for you guys as well as in the video. So if you guys want to see how I go from day to night, then just keep on watching. So usually if I have my makeup done pretty natural, I like to just rip off my lashes and that's probably the only thing that you're going to see change. That's going to be kind of drastic where you're like, okay, I need to either get a new pair of lashes if they're not just dramatic enough for you. Um, but as far as everything else, you're going to practically remain the same and maybe add a little bit more to your makeup So you look a little bit more done up The first thing I like to do is obviously you guys see there's already some brown shade to my lid This is just a bronzer that I normally add to My lid and it's the hula bronzer. I usually apply it all over my Crease so that gives it like that really nice and natural tone I'm going to go in there and get a fluffy brush and just grab an actual palette and this is going to be the KKW Mario palette and I'm going to go in there with the color Loyal Team and it is a darker brown and I'm just going to go in there and buff that in to the corners of my lid. You guys can see that. here. I love that I can create a super simple look. And you don't have to come home and wash your face. Like, I used to hate that I would, like, do my makeup in the morning um, to do something just quick. And then say, like, I don't know, my girlfriends or something or my friends wanted to go out for dinner or have drinks or something like that. I wouldn't really know how to just transition from, like, a day to night. So I would have to shower again and then redo my makeup and change the whole look. So you're going to see just how easy it is. I just kind of buff that in right at the bottom. And that just kind of like smokes everything out without really trying. Then I will go in there with a brown or a black liner. I'm going to go in there with a brown one today. And I begin to just line my top lid. This is probably the only time you'll ever see me applying um, liquid liner when I have my face done just because I love being able to do my eyeshadow and then my face if I'm doing liquid liner. That just gives me more control over my eye. All the products that I mentioned you guys I will have them linked down below for you guys. I usually just clean like the little corners just to really sharpen it. So at this point, you can decide whether you want to use the same lashes you were wearing if you're someone who wears like more natural lashes throughout the day um, to or transition to like a night look. You can do something more dramatic, but I love the lashes that I was wearing already. So I'm just going to pop those right back in. And normally, even when I have a natural look, my lashes are usually the ones that stand out. I usually like to wear like really dramatic lashes because I feel like it just opens up my eyes and makes it look like I'm actually trying to look cute and not looking like super, super natural, which is why the lashes that I actually have here are from the Lash Bar LA and these are in Ibiza.
you guys already see the look is already starting to come together and it just looks a little bit more like you're ready to go out and get some drinks um i'm gonna go in there with my bronzer now and i'm just going to bronze all those areas that I normally bronze and just kind of make it a little bit more bronzy, and especially when you're out at night or if you're at a restaurant or taking pictures or anything like that, sometimes you have to like add a little bit more than you normally would because you want it to come out in the pictures or you want to just be able to tell that you actually did your makeup when the lights are off. Um, so as my lashes are starting to just set on my eyes with the glue. I'm gonna go in there and finish off with my mascara for the eyes. Now to really help your eyes pop for this look, you can grab your preference of highlight. I'm gonna go in there with the Ofra Highlight in Rodeo Drive. And I'm going to just put those in my inner tear duct. To just kind of like make this look pop even more. I feel like me getting ready to just do nothing but getting glam just makes me feel so much better guys like you guys have no idea how much just getting ready really helps your mental health and just making you feel like you're not going crazy at home. So I love how that looks. In case you guys are wondering why I'm looking on this side, I have my monitor, but I love how that looks already. It looks super, super cute. Now, on top of that, we would go in there and then we would highlight again on our cheekbones. And this is just because usually if you're going from day to night, your makeup's probably all worn out by now. And you want to just kind of touch up those areas that are probably not as popping anymore. And then lastly, to finish off this just really pretty night look, we are going to go in there with lip gloss. I feel like lip gloss is always like go-to night look. I feel like lip gloss is always going to be the one that just makes your whole makeup look super glam. Uh, I'm going in there with the Beauty Creations color in the color Foxy. And this is probably one of my favorite lip glosses. I also um, love pairing this up with my everyday lipstick. The lipstick that I'm wearing is my lip liner by Kylie Jenner and this is in caramel and then the lipstick that I've been loving at the moment right now, let's see if I can find it, is Pilates I believe from uh, Stila. So I have been loving this lip combo and now with lip gloss, it really just brings this whole look together. And mind you, this is still really natural, which is what I love. It's like you wanted to do like a soft glam look. It's like you're not trying too hard, not trying too much. And it really just brings it together. And then for my setting spray, I'm going to go in there with Fenty Beauty. Just set my face. Now to top it off, um, say I'm going to wear a off-the-shoulder top. I wonder what I should wear today. <laughs> I'll figure that out. But we're going to be really trying to um, show the skin and show these little areas. The color that I... So at first, I was really loving the shade uh, Rose Quartz. But I did see that it was a little bit more on the um, natural side for me. Um, I wanted more, not natural because it was still very shimmery, but I wanted to just bronze my skin. I wanted to really just like high, not highlight and also like contour certain areas like my collarbone and then like here where my shoulders at. So I'm going to show you guys exactly how I like to apply it. So you can grab your preference of brush and then I usually squeeze out about two to three pumps. I used it for my photo shoot so it's almost like done it's literally like right at the bottom um so i'm going to just put it on i had a photo shoot a couple of days ago and i had all of the girls um bronzing because it was all pretty much like skin 
showing so i had them like all bronzing with this and they were they literally fell in love with it they were like dude this is so good i'm like i know it looks so flawless and especially right now like this really matches my shoulders um i've been tanning a lot outside in the pool so my my face is going to look a lot lighter i haven't been able to buy a foundation that matches my skin tone right now because i've been swimming every day um so if you do notice that my lower body looks a little bit more on the tanner side than my face that's why and then we're gonna go in there with the shade moonstone and this one's a little bit more like on the shinier side you want to add like extra shimmer and I, used to, I like to just add those to my actual collarbone to just really have it stand out i'm telling you everybody was obsessed with this combo at the photo shoot i was like oh my god everybody's glowing it looked so good i love it so this one is super lightweight guys as you guys know ofra they have literally one of the best highlight um formulas in all of the beauty industry and yes it's coming from me i love ofra i love all of their highlights and their pig how super pigmented it is so seeing that they came out with a shimmer body lotion i was obsessed because i am one to have i have actually tried a few of them like body shimmers when i wear my dresses and it's either too much or not enough or um it looks super glittery where it like transfers and this this one just doesn't transfer it sticks to where it's supposed to stick and it makes you look so glowy and super natural besides the two shades that i just showed you guys now on myself um, the three shades that it does come in are Topaz, it is Rose Quartz, and Moonstone. So these are the three shades that are available, guys. And like I said, I absolutely love it. And on top of that, it is cruelty-free, guys, and it's made in the U.S. Um, if you guys want any more information regarding the actual highlights, then I will have everything linked down below because I do have a coupon code with Ofra. Um, so once again, Ofra, thank you guys so much for sponsoring today's video. And this um, is the finished look, guys. So this is my night look. Um, I really wish that I could be going somewhere right now and showing this makeup off. Uh, I'm going to be giving one lucky winner $100 so you guys can go and splurge on the Ofra website. All you guys have to do is just comment down below. Let me know what your favorite Ofra product is in the comments down below in case my, there might be a product that I haven't tried that you guys are currently loving. You guys already know which products are my favorite, so I cannot wait to see which are yours. But I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. Thank you guys all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on my next one. Love you guys.